the other guy um, also in uh, in America, Michael Phelps, who is mm. probably the world's greatest athlete in his particular sport, his dominance, you know, 20 odd, um, mid 20s to late 20s in terms of gold medals, this guy, just an incredible swimmer, an mm. incredible athlete. But the story behind him, we talk about mental health, he's tried to take his own life three or four times and he's been caught DUI three or four times as well in his life. And, and the opportunity came for a Christian swimmer and a great friend of his to come alongside him uh, and to say, you know what, you need to, you need to build your uh, career on purpose, not on performance, not on the prize of medals, but on, on purpose. And he said, you know, there's a great book by Rick Warren called Purpose Driven Life. I'm going to give it to you and I need you to read it. It's transformed one of the world's greatest athletes who was deep in depression, didn't want to be on the planet anymore, uh, even though it seems like that's success. Ultimately, it's not. It's, 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 it's the third dimension where we find success ultimately. We know that. It's, it's the spirit and the heart of man which longs to be valued and to be loved, uh, that, that whole piece of being loved. That is just such an important thing as coaches to understand. How do you truly love people? How do you love people before you even bother about how well they perform? And that's some of the it's some of the key things the study of three D coaching goes through, and some great testimonies, some great stories of of what what that looks like, and the strategies that have been implemented to produce transformation and to produce the outcome that people can know a love that they never knew once before. And, and we know that's the most important thing that, that people would know the love of God.